welcome back to my youtube channel my name is ify if you're new here welcome and if you're a return subscriber welcome back so i want to appreciate you guys for the love you guys showed me on my last post thank you thank you so so much so i really really appreciate i want to tell you guys that i'm good i'm fine i'm doing great okay so thank you for the love so today's video i'll be showing you guys how i achieve this ponytail weave using expression attachment so if you want to learn it if you want to know how you can slay on your budget and if you also want to learn how you can achieve this on your own please keep watching and please don't forget to subscribe if you haven't subscribed and give me a thumbs up if you like this video also comment in the comment section if you're going to try this look or you like this video or you find it helpful so that's that so without further ado, let's get right into this video. So all you need is a pack of attachment depending on what you want to use it for. So what I wanted to use, I was going for polytail, so one was definitely enough. So I'm using expression, you can use any one that you want, any one that you can lay your hands on, so you can use it. So what I did was I bought it out, I divided it into three because I didn't want it to be too long, so I divided it into three and um... I bought out the tips to make the tips slimmer I don't know but you know normal braiding method so I just bought it out so let's watch guys So when you get to this point, you might want to oil your attachment and comb it very well so that it will be easier for you to pick. So I am making use of my manicure stand and my backdrop stand. So I just um, round the rope. I just put the rope around it, a thick rope. I make sure that the rope is thick. So now I'm about to show you guys what I did. So what you do is that once you pick out a section of the one you want, then you hold it right like that on your finger, as in like creating a circle or whatever it's called, put it right behind the rope and create a knot. It makes sense, right? I'm going to do it again. You bring out a section that you want to work with, then put round round it in your finger to make sure that it has a hole like that then you put it behind behind the rope then you create a knot once you put it behind the rope then you pass the other one you're holding with your right hand into the rope then you create a knot if it makes sense i hope this thing makes sense guys i i tried making this video more detailed and i know i tried so if you're watching it you know it's more detailed and i promise you're going to learn something so just calm down and watch it all right so let's keep going
so i'm just going to tie the both sides so it doesn't lose from there then after that i'm going to use a hot flat iron to uh, flatten the tips of or the edge the tips or the edge of um the bundle so you guys will see what i did in a short while i did just one bundle because i was going for polito so one bundle is enough so if you're going for um a wig or anything i want to do more than one bundle all right so keep watching guys so after trimming the edge you might want to do this because i did this because i don't want to find my hand or my finger inside the bowl of hot water <laughs> so i just if you if you, there's any other thing you would do fine but i just used um a hair pin to hold the tip so that it would be easier for me to dip it right inside the hot water when i want to dip it in all right so what i did was that I added my conditioner inside the hot water. I steam it together. Then I just put the the hair inside the hot water like normal, normal the way you do your braid. Okay, so I just put it inside the hot water. I brought it out, allow it to dry. Then that's just what I did. That is just it. Okay. so now your hair is ready to rock like is ready can you guys see this chai please give me a thumbs up if you find this video helpful if you find it interesting in fact i'm not saying you should you you must try this please sis my sisters try this i swear you're not going to regret it like why how can you tell me that you cannot slay? Eh? Can you guys see how I'm slaying this? <laughs> so please give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video. Comment in the comment section. I love you guys and I will see you in my next video. Until then, stay blessed and stay safe. Bye guys.